Hello guys, uh, welcome back to my channel Prince Automation Destination. So today we are going to discuss about collection framework in Java. Okay, so um, in Java, first of all, let, let us try to understand what is collection. So collection is nothing but a group of items, right? You you go to a shop and there is a collection of shirts. We, we, they say it like they, we have a collection of uh, the shirts, right? So collection is nothing but to group, group of uh, group up some some items right similarly in java also to group up dif, uh, the data types to uh, group up the data we have a java collection framework right so we have different type of collections so depending on the application so for example a list list uh, is one collection and set is another collection and map is another collection people are often confused whether map is part of java collection framework or not I say it is part of Java collection framework. I'll show you from the official documentation of uh, Java. Okay. And uh, then collection can store heterogeneous data and homogeneous data. What do we mean by heterogeneous data? Heterogeneous data means uh, different type of data within one collection. For example, I want to store list of uh, uh, like name as well as ages right within one collection. Meaning I want to store string as well as age right integer I mean then uh, this is how we can use for heterogeneous similarly we can use only string type or integer type i'll i'll uh, show you like how we can use it and we are going to mostly use um, the homogeneous type of it so let me go to the official uh, documentation of uh, java uh, so where it talks about the core collection interface encapsulate different type of collections so if you look at it these are the collection framework uh, uh, different uh, interfaces of collection framework foundation of the java, java collection framework so if you look at it even though map is uh, part of java collection framework it is not part of collection interface here the collection whatever we are talking about we are saying this is a collection interface i'll be showing you the hierarchy that i have devised out of uh, these so these are some of the interfaces that we need to deal so we are going to mainly discuss about set list then map right so uh, without further delay let me jump on to the uh, slide section where i have created one uh, diagram so i table is uh, uh, the root most node of uh, this collection interface right which is the parent of list and set in, and queue interfaces right so if you look at it this i table is one interface then collection is further extending it right so whichever is appearing in purple these are interfaces and whichever is appearing in green they are uh, classes okay so uh, interface in java means the type of entity which does not have a method defined defined means they had they don't have like method definition meaning they have declared the method but they haven't like defined the definition right so i table is one interface collection is further extending it and list and uh, list set and qr further extending extending it and then array list link list are implementing these interfaces so you would be thinking that why we have uh, like three interfaces right in this sequence if we look at it one two three similarly one two three one two and three so there is a uh, principle in um, java or in ops solid uh, as part of i principle of solid uh, interface segregation we are segregating the interface instead of keeping one interface as a pet interface i'll be discussing on the solid as well uh, soon so i table will have uh, its sort functions defined we will be discussing on those then collection would have some uh, other methods uh, declared so that and list will have its own method declared so that uh, method of this this and this become all all methods and array list is going to implement it right so this is how class implements the method of interfaces okay so let me discuss about the map uh, hierarchy as well map is the interface in the map hierarchy where it is not part of collection uh, uh, root node collection interface hierarchy i mean but this is this is part of uh, collection framework so abstract map is a class which is implementing this particular map interface and hash map linked hash map and tree map these are extending extending this uh, abstract map so without further delay let me jump on to the code side okay i'll first give you the clarity uh, like how they fall under uh, like uh, collection framework okay so let me show you let i'm navigating to list so if you look at this list um, you will uh, see this interface is a member of java collection framework 
right? And if you look at it, this list is extending uh, collection, which I just showed. List is extending collection, right? And then collection is uh, further, if I go here, it is extending iterable, right? And if I go to uh, this iterable, it is no more extending any any interface, right? So this is the rootmost uh, uh, node or rootmost interface of this collection uh, hierarchy, right? We are in like list set and uh, this falls. Similarly, I'm going to set now. If you would uh, go to set, set is also extending uh, collection and collection is further extending uh, iterable and uh, likewise iterable right so i mentioned earlier that they have different different methods right so iterable has defined some method iterator right uh, so most of the people would be aware like how the iterator works so we need to call iterator and it will return the iterator object right so these are some of the methods defined by iterator similarly if i go to collection so size is defined by collection and uh, Define means uh, I mean uh, in interface we can declare so it is declared I mean is empty is here contains is here so these are the methods defined by collection right if I now go to list uh, let me because we were coming from set right so uh, set has its own method for example it would have overwritten int size is empty right so these are some of the methods of set right so this way we are achieving the I principle of solid okay for solid I'll be uh, like covering our different series similarly now i am going to show you map right so people are often confused that whether it is part of collection framework or not if you look at it this interface is member of java collection framework right so they are like uh, multiple things okay if uh, for example i i just mentioned that they are like n number of uh, implementation if you look at it there are 421 implementation but we are mostly worried about hash map linked hash map and uh, uh, tree map right so let me, for example, go to implementation, right? You will see there are like multiple implementation of it. So let me search for hash map. So hash map, linked hash map, these are some of the implementation of it, right? Which we are going to discuss over the course of uh, uh, this series, right? So uh, this is uh, pretty much uh, about uh, this uh, collection framework introduction. So in the next series, we will be picking up uh, each one of the uh, like uh, Java collections, like list, set, and map and uh, different type of list, different type of set and different type of map and their application in the test automation. So that is it uh, for now. Thank you. Please uh, do like, share and subscribe if you really find it useful. Thank you for now.